What is that? Yeah, what the hell? Aunt Donna and Uncle Charlie, July 2010. I thought I heard something. You hear that? It's like down there. I thought I saw something move. Like all the way up there. As disciples of introspection, let empathy guide our actions and may the shimmering pools of contemplation. It's like those little magnet letters that your parents would put on the fridge when you were little. Hello, we heard somebody scream. If you're out here, call out to us. Gonna warm up. Oh yeah. Up. Oh. <laughs> Always stretch before a good hike, right? Oh yeah. Oh, okay. All right, guys. Welcome back to a brand new Randonautica adventure. Uh, so we are out here in the freezing cold. Uh, we are starting to hit actual freezing temperatures now in Canada. It's not lovely, um, but we'll bear with it just for you guys to get this content. Uh, so, I am with my good friend Brad, he is currently holding the camera for me, for this part. Um, we've actually been out for a few hours already, and let me tell you, we've found some really, really creepy stuff so far. Um, but before we get into that, I did want to say... Superman. <laughs> 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 so if you guys want to get some merch, I know you've been asking. Uh, we eliminated the old merch. We now have the Brave merch uh, with the cool rattlesnake on it. Uh, totally custom made, one of a kind. But um, yeah, like I said, we got Brad. Go and subscribe to his channel. Um, also, leave us some intents down below for the next few series. We're going to be doing a little bit of this, and then I think next week I'm probably going on a road trip. Uh, hitting the road in the United States probably gonna go and see some really awesome people uh, Probably gonna do some haunted locations, so that should be fun And we'll also be able to kind of mix it up a little bit here on the channel as well <sighs> Apart from that, uh, let's go freeze our butts off in some forests and uh, See what it is that we can find smash the like button and uh, let's get the adventure started. Okay, so um, first point and uh, I've been here before <laughs> like on the on the on the point that I have set literally up, like that, your that area? your point is literally right down there, right? I yeah, knew exactly yeah. as soon as we pulled into this intersection, I knew exactly where I was. Oh, okay. I was here the other day and uh, I ran an intent. Well, obviously before getting here, yeah, the intent blew, and it's crazy how accurate it was because it actually worked. Oh, okay. So, um, weirdly enough that it's now telling you that your point is here. Yeah, like, exactly. What, what the hell? So, <coughs> can you read this? I, I mean, I don't have to, obviously, like, if you guys seen this, probably already in his video. I mean, you can go and read it yeah. anyways, but... Yeah. Um, so this is a historic landmark. Okay. Yeah, apparently the natives used to use these, uh, these lands to go from one side to the other. Oh, yeah. yeah there you go. They used to travel through here. So funny enough was that my intent was uh, something blue. Look at the sign. You see that? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, oh, that was the last time. Cool. This time is different, but. Cool. Kind of like how they made this cross. That's yeah. Cool. Well, that's just the. Mm, the never eat shredded wheat. You know that, right? Yep. That's Don't the ever way eat you know. shredded wheat. <laughs> Holy smokes, and look at the year here. Yeah. We got uh, 1619 to mm -hmm. 1793. And then there's like this big map, guys, going up. That's really cool. Yeah, I wasn't able to see it all properly last time, so it's kind of nice to see this time. Yeah. Hmm. So, was Woodbridge always Woodbridge back then? Is that how this works? <laughs> I, I guess so. Yeah, yeah, because I mean, certain townships did have different names. Like, you know, with Sega Beach, it actually yeah. used to be called Schooner Town or something. Oh, really? Yeah, Schooner huh. Town. Interesting. I think that has to do with ships or something. <laughs> something. Yeah, that would make sense. Yeah, because they had a ship, it was called the Schooner. That's what's on the dime, right? Oh, okay, okay. I believe. Yeah. Or am I. No, is that the Blue Nose? I don't know, I'm getting all my ships confused, but... <laughs> <laughs> One uh, of the ships, okay? Yeah. One of the ships, people. Weirdly enough, so there's kind of like a trail, it looks like, that kind of runs this way and that way. Yeah. Um, I heard some weird noises, and at first, like, 
when I was here the last time, those noise, at first I was kind of like, okay, maybe they're just animals. Yeah. Um, but then after reviewing the footage, I'm pretty sure it was not an animal. It okay. sounded like a human, so I don't know. How far back was your, your point? Was it so like up there or like right here? Back here, but what's awkward is that it's like, I think it's, I don't really think this is trail. Like if you come up, like yeah. it kind of looks just you, like. You can walk up there because I went up there last time. Yeah, I saw. Yeah, like I mean, it looks like there's kind of like. Yeah. Here. It just looks kind of rough, that's all. Yeah. Yeah. Well, last time I didn't find anything, so I mean. Attempt number two? Yeah. It's actually funny, I was with uh, Brady and the radius was actually big. Yeah. So we went in the one side and we actually thought this was complete dud. Okay, we're going to set a new one. Yeah. And then when we're coming out of the woods, Brady's like, hold on a second. Oh, you There's noticed actually something? actually another trail. Ah. It's in the same, same vicinity. Okay. So then we went in there and we did find some stuff. Yeah. 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 All right, well, let's uh, keep our eyes open. I mean, like last time I'm highly doubtful there's gonna be any anything here so from here I guess I'll run my intent after this um, see where else it takes us but I'm just gonna start out here first see cuz it's not even really like a trail it's just a like an opening really No, I'm just saying it's not it's not a trail, but people last time I was here there was footprints that came through here. That's why I came up this way. Oh, okay. Yeah. And you're saying your point is a little bit up this way anyway, so. Oh damn, hard to walk. Yes, it reminds me of I kind of want to Dream? check the whole thing to see if there's like, <laughs> Yeah. Oh, I thought those were lights. They're just reflectors. <laughs> huh? What that is. What? Well, it looks like a memorial kind of thing. A memorial? What is it? Candle holder, <sighs> no candle. Oh, wait a second. Yo, what? There is something on the back of it here. Can I, can I see it? Yeah, so it says, uh, Shelly, this is the key for you to always remember me. Love, Tyler. Oh. That's kind of weird. That is weird. Maybe somebody passed away and they... Places. I know, We've and been finding a lot of stuff like stuff that lately. Stuff to do with people passing away. Yeah. Eh? Yeah, it's weird. I'll leave that there. That's terrible. I I honestly feel very very bad for like people that have lost a loved one, especially in areas like this. Because you start thinking like, what if they like, what if it was a car accident or like, you know, something really bad, right? Is there a person there? Or am I just seeing? Okay, I'm just seeing. <laughs> I thought I saw somebody standing there for a second. <laughs> Maybe it was a ghost. I'm gonna check this whole here. Yeah, you check that side, I'll check this side. I mean, I, there's less snow this time than last time, so it's a little bit easier to see stuff. Did you see anything on that side? No. What about you? Yeah, there's something here. <laughs> this place is weird. What is that? Is that a little chair? I think it's a chair. Oh, it is a little chair. Oh, that's cool. That is cool. I did not see that last time. And were you in this area? Like I this came right area? through here. I'm, I mean, I might have just missed it. Maybe I just didn't see it, but... Yeah, yeah. <coughs> oh, man. The air's oh, so dry here. tonight. <clears throat> Somebody literally put a little chair. <laughs> oh, made in that is China. so funny. That's kind of cool, actually. Just a little wooden chair. Yeah, yeah. It looks pretty neat. That is cool. Huh. 
And these things to do, so that's something. Yeah, well, we found a chair. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> a chair and a memorial, so nothing too crazy. Yeah. Oh. All right, well, uh, go a little further down and... It's <sighs> a lot of shrubs. I can only imagine the overgrowth in the summer over here. <sighs> I guess that's it. Yeah, that's it for mine, man. Alrighty, well, I guess we'll head back to the car and uh, reset and try another one. I'll yeah. do mine this time and see what happens. Sure. Sounds good. Yep. Alright, so I never even realized this. It took us a second to figure this out, but apparently there's a trail right across the street. And the only reason I even figured that out was because that is where our next point is. Um, so we have a point which is the best of intentions from Jen on Twitter. So shout out to you. Um, there's a little trail. So we're going to take it and I guess see what's down there. Sweet. Yeah. All right. Let's go. Oh, I see some orange thing. I didn't even realize this last time. I did not notice this. Huh. What? That there was even a trail here. <laughs> Yeah, like we, last time I came, literally went across the street, then ran another point and left, and that was it. Yeah. Um, but... So I'm sorry guys, I just wasn't vlogging when... Let's go. This is Angelo's coordinate, and... Um... What was your in, uh, intent, by the way? The best of intentions. The best of intentions. Yeah, I thought it was kind of quirky, so I mean our intent is the best of intents, essentially. Yeah, <laughs> so, cool. uh, yeah. Oh, look, look at these pillars, man. It's like we're walking into like a... I know, right? <laughs> it just looks super cool. The funny thing, too, is that look how many walking sticks there are. Oh, my God. That one's like oh, frozen. Oh, no way. It's frozen in the ground. walking sticks? Yeah. Oh, hold They're already on. ready to go. Okay. Oh, oh the doggy... Frozen... Doggy bag? Frozen <laughs> doggy bag, I guess. Frozen doggy bag, man. All right. Well, here we go. We got weapons. We're good to go, man. <sighs> Yeah, if anybody comes at us, I'll just uh, beat them with my stick. <laughs> now, we do got to walk a little bit because points uh, fair ways in, it looks like. That trail looks super cool. Yup. I literally almost just stabbed myself with a walking stick. <sighs> I get a lot of questions about like, all of our dangerous wildlife. I really don't know the list. No, what is that? Yeah, what the hell? It kinda looks like it is. Oh well, that actually worked out really well. <laughs> uh, okay. There's something like taped to it. Now I got the bulky gloves on, so this is gonna be a bit of a challenge. Hang on. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, it's like there's something on here. It's definitely a little dull. Mm -hmm. It looks like it has no head. Yeah, that's creepy. That is creepy. I hate finding this dismembered stuff. I just don't know what it means. Yeah, I think it's just people messing around, but... Yeah. Here, you want to pull that? Oh, just, yeah. yeah, I'm just gonna hold the tape and there we go. Oh. What the hell? Is that? Yo. Oh, oh dude, it's a clown. Oh my god, I Wait. hate this stuff. It's another... We found one of these the other night, yeah, right? Yeah, it's a, me a sound maker? Yeah, it's like some little old toy. Let me see that. Yeah. See, I start seeing this stuff, and all I can think of is those brothers. Where'd like, that doll go? Because they they collected clown memorabilia, and the I don't brothers. know if it's from uh, this those, is like, from Japan. Killers or whatever the that killers, you mentioned. The killers, yeah. It was so funny. So everybody's saying like, "That's the Mendez brothers," and I'm like, "The, the Mendez, Mendez brothers, brothers are still in jail. <laughs> like, uh -oh. it's not. Maybe them. there's like." Like copycats or something? A similar kind of story, yeah. Like abused by parents and then... That's really off, weird. Off, off, a off. random thing to find. It's kind of weird. Just the fact that we found something so similar. I'm pretty sure the other one was red, but it also had a clown on it. Yeah. Okay. I'm oh, just gonna... and what's weird is it looks like this was just made without a head. Oh, yeah. 
You know what I mean? It doesn't look like there was ever... Yeah. Um, I mean, unless you think that that was taken off, but it looks to me know. like it never had it. Yeah, I think you might be right, to actually. Begin with, right? Okay, well... That's a <laughs> interesting thing to start off with. See, that's it. I'm taking you off. Huh? This looks a little bit more... Uh... There you go. Yeah, the you could have that one if you want. <laughs> <sighs> Fighting to put my... Uh... My glove back on. There we go. Sorry for all the awkward movements, guys, but. <laughs> okay. Oh. Alright, flashlight. Work. Hello? Come on. <sighs> For some reason my flashlight doesn't even want to turn on. Found something. What the hell? Oh. It's like frozen, dude. Yeah. I think so. Yeah, it's been here for a while. Look, it's like completely frozen over, basically. Guess how much I love you. I, I don't know. <laughs> What's the image on it? I don't know. Oh, there's like a rabbit. Oh, okay, yeah. yeah, it's a... There's two rabbits. It's the mama rabbit and the, the baby rabbit. Oh, okay. Oh. Yeah, that's something. Two... Nevaye love aunt donna okay it's kind of hard to see that with the camera but yeah aunt donna and uncle charlie july 2010 that is very random i find it so weird you find these things and it's like i know right i mean this obviously belonged to these people and then it was just kind of yeah. left here I have a feeling I don't I was gonna run by you too. Yeah. Do you ever find like maybe you know these parents took their kids on a hike or whatever and they brought this with them and then you know kids being kids they just silly dropped and they it. Set it down yeah. And it's it. possible. Yeah. I mean it's kinda weird that it would be unless it's been here even longer than that, but in yeah. the middle of winter seems kind of odd to me. Yeah, that's just gonna true. just I'm not even gonna lie. That's in just, the summer uh, that would be more realistic. Yeah, but. I don't I don't know. It's hard to say, man. I find so many random different things that just make no sense. Uh, oh, there we, there we go. Yeah, I think I was just not turning it on properly. What's back there? Some sort of fence. Uh, I'm assuming that's like a no trespass sign, maybe? That yeah, could just be somebody's private. property. Yeah. All right. Yup. Is that... Why is there just a pair of shoes out here? Yeah, that is weird. Yeah, tell me about it. Uh... Okay. They look pretty old. Oh, well, maybe somebody just bought new shoes and left their old ones here. <laughs> yeah, really? <laughs> I guess? I don't know. That's weird. I guess so. Uh, man, it's cold tonight. I thought I heard something. You hear that? It's like down there. Yeah, I think it stopped too. What was that? Oh, it's an owl. Is it? Yeah. Oh, it is. Oh, yeah. Cool. <laughs> what was really scary? Yeah. On one hike, we were so close to one. It was gigantic. Oh, yeah? It was just gigantic owl chilling yeah. in a tree. 
Hmm. And I'm like, don't go too close. I don't know if they're I don't know if they're dangerous. I don't know. I don't think they would really do anything. Yeah, and he was just kind of chilling. You know what's more too. dangerous? Canadian raptors. Now those are dangerous. There you go. They'll they'll fly right at you if they want. They'll hiss and they're just mean. But you know what you do? You just hit them in the neck. That'll make them screw <laughs> off. Punch them in the neck. Yeah. Use a stick. Okay. <laughs> Where is the owl? I want to see an owl. That's cool. Yeah, I know. I would love to capture them on film. They're actually my favorite animal. Is it your, is it your spirit animal, Brad? It's my spirit animal. Now. Yeah. You know what my <laughs> my spirit animal is? What? A salamander. Oh, well, there you Just go. Just blends right in. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, salamanders are cool. Wait, I think I just saw something down there. I thought I saw something move. Like all the way up there. Okay. Hello? Mr. Owl? I don't know. Yeah, this place is creepy. So I think we would have, must have made it to the point. I'm not seeing anything else, so, so far we found what? A pair of shoes, a book, and that weird, like, headless doll with that clown. Yeah, that was weird. Yeah. I hate finding clown stuff, man. It's Should just... we maybe run another point and see where it takes us? Yeah. I guess. Alright. What in the actual hell was that? You heard that, right? That sounds terrifying. Yeah. Someone literally like screamed from down there. Hello? What the hell is up there? It's creepy. It's creepy. We just found the shoes, right? Right. Somebody up there? I mean, does somebody, like, need assistance, or...? I know, like, I wish we could find these people, too. Yeah. You hear the scream, you figure these... I mean, it could just be, like, kids f***ing around, but... Mm -hmm. I don't know. So we were gonna leave, but... Um... I guess not? I mean, now I have to know. If somebody, like, needs help, I'm not gonna just turn back and leave. There's a sign down there. Yeah. Hello? Oh, it goes down. Well, that's uh, hard for visibility. <laughs> Yeah, plus now we're hearing something. Yeah. I mean, it's kind of weird too because there was no other cars there, just us. Yeah. Um, so unless they came in from the other side, I got no idea. See anything or no? There's no one there. Oh, 
Yeah. I swear I just heard something on the left there. Like something moved or... Uh, I don't know. I mean, it's strange because we're hearing people yeah. here and there. Now I'm hearing something moving. Hello. I don't know. Whatever moved, it sounded like it came from down here. That? Looks like a piece of paper. Or something, I don't know. Wanna go check? Yeah, What is it? I don't know what's been going on with this. I have been finding envelopes lately. Last video, I did find an envelope with a little R. Oh. I have no idea what it means. It's like a full letter. Yeah. A lot of times I just think that a lot of this stuff is just discarded mail. Like when you do first find yeah. it, you're like, what the heck? I mean, this one. doesn't look like it was mailed or anything. There's nothing on the front. Huh. Yeah, like it's just, just a blank envelope with an R. Stuff that's <laughs> okay. left behind. For who, I don't know, because none of it's addressed. All right. But I heard something I behind us. Like directly behind you, I thought something moved. I'm not hearing anything. Just Me neither. This place gives me creeps. All right, I'm gonna try to open this one handed. We'll just see how that goes. Oh, I just heard it again. Something moved out there. Hello? I feel like we're being watched or something. It's really weird. And the scream came from down here too. Yeah. So like, what's going on? Who knows how far down though? That's the only problem. I know. Like, I literally have absolutely no idea at this point. Okay. Oh, wow. There's something here. What the hell? What is Some that? Some sort of image. Okay. What is that? Okay, so we just found this right now, guys. Looks like some weird looking ghoulish yeah. thing. I don't know what that is. Oh, here we go. So there is a note. Oh. Dear devotees of the reflectionists, in the ethereal embrace of our secluded village, our shared pursuit of enlighten enlightenment binds us. It has come to our attention that a wandering soul, unfamiliar to our sacred grounds, has been found exploring the realm of our reflective wisdom. Great. Just so weird. it's another cult. <laughs> That's yeah. what it seems like yeah, to me. Yeah, of course. What I mean, you've got new? like, I mean, like, look at what we've been seeing lately. Yeah. People in cloaks and things like that. What did it like say? That. Reflective what now? Reflective wisdom. Reflective I don't even know what that wisdom. means. <laughs> Are you reflecting on your wisdom or something? I don't, I don't yeah. know. That's beyond me at this point. With okay. utmost reverence of our, for our beliefs, let us approach this interloper with an open heart and a patient spirit. I've never heard of that word before. Interloper? Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. Isn't that like the name of a movie? It sounds like Isn't it, the name it? of a movie with Matt Damon? I think. Probably. Interloper? <laughs> or I could be just totally mistaken right now, but... Yeah. Anything else? The aura of reflectionists is one of tranquility and understanding. Seek to comprehend the purpose of her presence. For hmm. in this exchange, we may uncover new facets of our own enlightenment 
May our collective reflections guide us in welcoming the seeker into the fold, or, if necessary, gently redirect her to the paths from which she strayed. As disciples of introspection, let empathy guide our actions and may the shimmering pools of contemplation illuminate the truth that binds us all. In harmony and introspection, the reflectionist elders. Like, this is just Weird. very, very strange. Yeah, and like, I don't understand cults. Like, from what I've researched, they weren't like this. There were a lot of like, very uneducated people. Like, they're using mm -hmm. a lot of big words. I, yeah. I've never even heard of these words, so. All right, well, uh, put it back. Yeah. <laughs> I don't I don't want that anywhere near us. No. I've, I, I've kind of had enough of these cults as of late. Do you think just leave it under the rocks? <laughs> Let's just put it back where we found it. I don't know how it got there. I don't really want to know, but. Yeah. Um, okay. Okay, I just heard something that way now. Like a whistle or something. Kind of behind behind me. Okay, I don't yeah. like that. Because if it's a whistle, it could mean like, oh, they got the package. You know what I mean? Maybe, like type yeah. of scenario. Yeah, like I said, if, if somebody's like actually watching us right now, I don't want to know. Don't forget your gloves. Yeah. Um... But maybe let's go a little further down. Okay. I mean, like I said, we heard a scream. I'm hoping this is not like some weird kind of trap. I'd also like to point out that if anything, Brad has a horn <laughs> and we'll just yeah. deafen them to death. So this is actually hilarious. So <laughs> Betty, she's always, she see, she watches our videos back, right? And she's like, I'm so scared of for you guys getting hurt or eaten or attacked. <laughs> so she gets me this foghorn and I guess it scares off like bears, I predators. I don't know. Uh, you know. I guess we'll wait for the moment to actually have to use it. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe that's what we heard. Maybe there's a bear down there and he's screaming for help. You heard that whistle. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I heard that clear as day. That was very, very clear. Because that's the thing. Some of the groups, they use that as a form of communication. Yeah. Okay, I figured as much. Let's get some uh, some light. And I also noticed some of you guys are asking what kind of light we use. It is an Olight. My link is down below if you want to get one with a discount. Go and uh, support the channel and support the companies that support the channel too. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm still hearing something down there. Just listen for a second. I mean, it could just be like maybe coyotes. I don't know. Yeah. Or foxes. Foxes make strange sounds as well, but. Hey, f you coyotes! We have a horn. <laughs> <laughs> know your role. <laughs> <laughs> Well, look at that. There's like a giant rock wall right here. That's oh, kind of yeah. cool. Yeah. It's like fenced off, so. Yeah, it's somebody's property, I guess. Yeah, it goes like all the way down. Yeah, what the hell? Uh, we got something here. Oh, holy smokes. Yeah, there's something right there. Uh, okay. Got a cigarette butt. Okay. Like an old box. Oh, this thing is really old. <laughs> like a little mirror. Yeah, it's like, oh, it's like those little magnet letters that that your parents would put on the fridge when you were little. Okay. 
there's a note here. No, uh, there's something on it. Alright, the gloves are coming off. I know. Those gloves are really warm, damn. <laughs> uh, okay. Ah. One handed, removing an elastic band. Ah. <laughs> the challenge. <laughs> the challenge of being a. The challenge is real. Man. Yeah. Let me yeah, just. We uh, <laughs> for a second. There we go. Got it. It says, the world is ours. Got a bunch of snow on the camera now, of course. Awesome. Yeah, it literally says, is the world it? is ours. And then it says, echo. Okay. That's kind of weird. Yeah. There's just a bunch of, like, random letters in here. We got a T. I R P K A nope, that's a G. Another A, no, that's the only A so far. For some reason I thought there was two A's. Yeah. C an H and an R. Um I don't know. To be honest with you, I can't, I would not be able to figure that out. Yeah. At this moment in time. If you guys have any idea what that might spell. Oh, I think we missed a letter. Oh, There's another okay. one here. Like an I? Hmm. I guess it could be No, an I think that's an L, because this one's an I. It's got a little, oh, okay. little circle thing, right? Yeah. I don't know. That's really weird. The world is ours. Echo. Okay, well, that doesn't make much sense. <laughs> so the last time I was in the woods, we found notes. It looked like kids drew them. It really? It looked like, yeah, like the printing. Everything was very, very sloppy. Okay. So I don't know if you've ever found anything like that. I was just kind of like, this is so strange. Yeah. We were on this, like, wild goose chase. Yeah. So. I don't know. Yeah. That's To me, this is, like, virtually meaningless. Like, I cannot figure out what yeah. the hell that's supposed to mean um kind of weird is there anything else i mean we can go a little further i kind of want to see what this whole screen thing is about like in this whistle like, yeah i mean we haven't see seen anybody that's the thing so if somebody was out there we would have heard them or seen them by now i'd imagine anyway all right well i'm gonna put my glove back on uh yeah i don't know man i don't know what to make of this Kind of, yeah, kind of weird and strange so far. Yeah. That's per usual, I suppose. It's like everything just stopped, though. Like there's no more, no more sounds, nothing. Yeah, it's, it's, it's just dead silence. Dead silence now at this point. It's too, with the, uh, I don't have a. It's I mean, I was facing you, so because I'm using the longer shotgun mic, it yeah. might not have picked it up because it was facing, because of the direction it was facing. Yeah. So, is what it is, I suppose. Yep. I don't see anything in particular. I don't know how much farther we really want to go. Yeah, it's your call, bro. Yeah. I mean, like, if you, if you feel like you want to turn back and... I mean, look, let's go up a little further. Let's see if there's anything else here, because clearly we're finding stuff. Yeah. No idea what the hell any of it means, but... Down to that, I kind of like the look of the doors. It looks really cool. <laughs> Let's just go like down there, and then if there's nothing around, then probably just turn back. So I'm getting a little cold out here. Oh damn! 
This goes a long ways. <laughs> Hello, we heard somebody scream. If you're out here, call out to us. <sighs> nothing, bro. There's nothing out here. Yeah. Well, uh, I guess maybe that's our cue to go back. Yeah, I guess so. Warm up in the I mean, car I don't, feel, and I don't feel I'm in any danger or anything yeah. like that. I feel like this stuff was just left and like these people probably took off. Who knows? Um, yeah. Kind of weird, the stuff that we did find, to say the yeah. least. But, uh, I don't know. I guess we'll head back to the car, warm up, and then uh, try again. Yeah, sounds good to me, man. Alright. Oh, it's chilly out there. Oh. <sighs> Excuse me. <laughs> I'm uh, <laughs> so, I realized that, um, I don't even know if it was the last video or the video before that, um, I found this random note, it was with like a bunch of really, really old checks. Okay. That had been cashed a long time ago, like large sums of money. Pretty yeah. wild. Then I remembered, because I took the note and I shoved it in my coat and I had completely forgotten about it. And just now I was like taking all the spare batteries that I usually keep in my jacket out and I'm like, oh, a note. So I never finished reading it because at that time somebody was coming up the trail so I kind of like decided to leave. Okay. Um, but it says something along the lines of Dear Gary, I think, not quite sure. It says, it has been quite some time since we have spoken and I hope all is well 52 years in fact however i do need to ask a favor of you since the last time we saw each other a lot has changed my two daughters have married uh one to a wonderful man the other i think it says tiffany not so much i need someone to tell Joseph some manners. I'm going to assume it says teach Joseph some manners. Okay. If you catch my drift. This is all in cursive, so it's a little bit hard to read. Yeah. Uh, let me know if you can help us out. Uh, and then I think it says John something. I can't even read the last name. But yeah, that's really weird. So I found that's this it. with, a, like I said, a bunch of old checks. I think they were from like the 70s. Okay. And they had all been cashed a very, very long time ago. So oh, I don't understand okay. what the significance to a bunch of checks and um, this. Yeah, yeah, that's strange. That's really, really weird. So yeah, I just figured since we never finished reading it the first time, we might as well finish it now. Um, but yeah. I think we'll uh, head somewhere else, run some more intense, some for Brad's channel, some for my channel. I don't know, man. But yeah, I've been finding a lot of these weird things related to this Parker group. And okay. I found out the other day, they're hackers. Oh. So anyway, I thought it was a cult, but it's not even a cult because we always find cult stuff. Yeah. First time I've ever found anything significant to hackers. Yeah. Um, and it was explaining something, I don't know, just very, very weird stuff, but yeah. Maybe that'll be my next intent. Maybe I'll do mm. Parker, just to see what the hell comes up. You know what's strange about this too? So I've actually, I, I just kind of researched them for fun. Yeah. Hackers are in groups, and the reason being, so if one of them goes to jail or something happens, yeah. they bail each other out. Oh, okay. I mean, because I mean, they, they do a lot of things to get themselves money or information yeah. or things, yeah. right? So that's, that's uh, what they do. That's weird. Yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, I guess that kind of like it makes sense to me, but I don't, know, I don't know what the hell these guys are all about. Just mm -hmm. been finding re re really weird clues as of late. Um, Sorry, it's, uh, my, my lips are dry. Oh, it is, I it is totally so freaking get it. cold out right it now. It is cold. Like, you guys don't understand. Like, it is currently minus one degree Celsius. I don't even know what that is in Fahrenheit. Probably like 30, maybe. Something yeah. like that. 
but it's the air is so dry right now that it's like within like an hour you're you're absolutely freezing and but. you ever find that the blood in your hand just stiffens up and then there's oh, yeah. a you get to a point where you can't move your fingers yeah yeah I try so to tell people it's, you it's need cold really here. really good gloves yeah uh, <laughs> to withstand and good good footwear and socks and stuff like that mm -hmm. so all right let's head to another uh area and see what the hell else is uh out there let's do this all right guys so we've made it to our next point um apparently there is another trail ahead of us it looks like some sort of tract or something we're gonna walk in and see what the heck the sign says looks like a pretty big place um the intent was actually parker hopefully we can find out what the hell these guys are all about um maybe using the intent maybe we'll find nothing who knows <laughs> all i know is it's uh roll the dice cold <laughs> that's literally all i know at this point so let's go all right fight the bite fight the bite man fight the bite brad <laughs> Don't I get got bit, bit. By a tick, actually. did you? Oh yeah, it's like this this year. Yeah, Betty got it out. It was on my back. I had no idea, and it was it was cold. Yeah. So I was like, how the hell did this happen? But yeah, they can survive in colder. It countries. was it was in the winter. Um, or like oh, fall. I guess it was fall, so, like, right? Halloweenish. Yeah. Oh, right, yeah. Right. Yeah, ticks are annoying, man. I've been uh, I've been stuck by a few of those those pricks before. All right, so we apparently are in the. Happy Valley tract. We got Brad with a stick, so don't mess with him because he will beat you. Yeah. Uh, apparently, there's a lookout. That's interesting. Oh, I'll hopefully yeah. find that. Yeah, we'll see if we can find that. That's cool. Um, uh, let's operation of unmanned aerial vehicles, drones in the York Regional Forest. Well, at least we got none of that. <laughs> no drones in the forest. Yeah, oh, well, my point looks like it's down off to the right, I think. How would they even know? Well, I guess if they catch you, like... Yeah. Yeah, just don't get caught doing it. Get the uh, flashlight on here so we can see. It's hard to turn the flashlight on with these bulky-ass gloves. <laughs> <clears throat> So when we were getting out, we heard some coyotes. It sounded like they were all down that way. It sounded kind of far though. Yeah. I think yeah. Should, should be okay. Right. Yeah. There's like a. <laughs> I think that there's a nest up there. Huh. Yeah. All right. Gotta love these trails with the free walking stick. I know. There's like a random tree there this area looks really different though yeah it looks very uh almost deserty if you ask me i don't, I don't know huh i kind of dig this yeah that's kind of cool. what the oh, area oh yeah yeah yeah, yeah. Oh, boy. there's some behind you not some one something on the floor Holy there smoke. yeah what sorry i might have made you poop your pants yeah i didn't even see that what is that uh, pretty far. Definitely not here. <sighs> what the hell? This echo began long ago? What the hell is that supposed to mean? It says echo again. Yeah. Let me put this in front of you because it's like focusing on you instead of... Oh, shoot. Yeah, sorry about that. What the hell was that behind me? You heard that, right? Yeah, it was like a little thump. It was weird. Okay, anyway, I don't know what that's supposed to mean. This echo began long ago. Oh, there's more. Wanna hold that for a sec? Yep. Kind of running out of hands here. To, uh, turn it around. So, is that the same people? Looks like it says... Uh, Martha, Joseph, Philip, 1924. Oh. So it's who's an who? Old vintage photograph. I mean, I'm gonna assume that's Martha. Yeah. Mm, that's either Joseph or Philip, well, either or. I'm assuming the baby. Yeah. That's weird. You know what's weird? I just realized this. The last point we were at, we found that box and it said Echo. Yeah, like I don't, maybe like Echo to the. Past or maybe? something oh, like no. something like that. 
something to do with the past? I have no idea. Okay, well, uh, might as well carry on. <sighs> Somebody, uh, lost their photo, apparently. <laughs> Old photo, my gosh. Damn, this is creepy. Very, very creepy. Oh, we got something else here. Oh, look at that. What the hell? Oh, dude, look. There's no way. Look at what it says. The world is ours. That was like the oh, last place. Dude. Went, so something I've seen that What's symbol this? before. What the hell? That's them. That's those Parker people, I'm telling you. The, the people that I've been telling you about? Yeah. Yeah. That's literally them. Hear our echo. I don't even know what the f*** that's supposed to mean, but... So do you think it's just a family? Like, it's not so much as a cult, but like a family? Like, I have or no idea. I mean, that is a very good question. Uh, I'll just leave that there. We're not even, like, anywhere near the point yet. Holy crap. Oh, almost dropped my flashlight. Dude, what the f***? So we found... <sighs> I'm trying to put this all together. Like, this doesn't... I don't understand what the hell these people want. <laughs> yeah, <it's laughs> like, I've been, over the last couple of weeks, it's been non-stop with these Parker people. And I keep finding more and more clues about whatever this weird hacker group is. Or at least that's what they call themselves. Yeah. I don't know. Very strange, but... Let's carry on. So where's this damn lookout thing? And what are we looking out at? Okay, that's just coming from the plane. <laughs> I thought there was like something howling out there really loud. I think there's a house up there. It's my guess anyway. Wow, as if we just found that stuff, that's crazy. Look at all this. This is cool. Kind of creepy. I should probably check where this point is exactly. Um, just so we know. I'm not gonna lie, if there was anybody hiding out here, this would probably be the perfect spot. I know. Right? We got a few trees and yeah. This, uh, this has the making of a horror movie right here. <laughs> it's just it's just too perfect. Yup. Alright, so we found those two things, but I'm not really seeing anything else. Hello? I don't know what it is about this place, but it's really spooky. Yeah, this place gives me the creeps. Yep. Anybody out here? I think I've never seen a trail like this before. Me neither. It's very different. Yeah, with all these, uh, what would you call these? Ferns? Mostly, I think. Pines? Pine trees? No, I'm definitely not a tree expert either, so your guess is about as good as mine. All right, well, I guess we'll go up this hill and uh, I'm gonna take a quick look at Google and see where the hell we're going. Ooh. Okay.
Oh, nothing. So that's strange. We found those two things almost at like the almost the beginning. Yeah. Not quite the beginning, but almost the beginning. And then we get here and there's nothing. Um, yeah, I'm gonna take a second and check where we are. Okay, so uh, checked Google Maps. Apparently the point was literally just down there. So that was it. Okay. Apparently the world is theirs. I don't even know what that's supposed to mean, but <laughs> you guys at home tell me what you think because this stuff is just very strange. Makes no sense whatsoever. Um, but we're gonna go ahead and run a point for Brad now and uh, I guess just see what we find. Um, what in the actual hell? Dude, is that like a ammunition shell or something? What the hell is that? Yeah, we almost didn't even see it. We were literally about to leave. And, uh, then Brad's like, what the hell is that gold looking thing? Yeah, dude. Uh. That's a big round, dude. Yeah. You know what's crazy? What? This is not the first time I've uh, found one of these. No? No. Like, when, when did you find one? Uh, not too long ago. I'll, I'll show you in a second, but I'm gonna maybe pull that out. Yeah, what the hell is that? It's like stuck. Okay. Yikes. Yikes. Yeah, it looks like some sort of... Oh, dude. What does that say? So it says... We took care of your little problem with Sergi, I think. S E R G E I. You Sergei? owe us a large debt, and there's that symbol again. See you soon, Echo. Oh, sh that Echo stuff, dude. Yeah, it's this Echo stuff again. Get it, man. Okay. That's it. The back of it. That's it. Yeah. I owe a large debt, dude. Uh yeah, you know, I mean, this was definitely intended towards you. Yeah, no kidding. This is those Parker people again. Mm -hmm. The globe, the, the literally the globe that we just found on the trail had the same logo all over it. It looked like it was in every continent or whatever. Does it say what kind of ammunition shell this is? Or? I have no idea, but... So what if these people let's were just, like... Let's, let's get in the car for a yeah, second. Yeah, yeah. Okay, um, I just wanted to get in the car because first of all, it's warmer in here. And yeah. we were out there for like literally, what, almost an hour? <laughs> Freezing, bro. So it is frigid, but I'm going to show you something. Um, so this is what we just found. Mm -hmm. um, I know I put the other one right there. Two. Oh, wow. That one's a little bit smaller. It's a little different. No, it's the same. Oh, they're the same size? Yeah. Sorry, on camera. Yeah, it looks a little different. They're literally exactly the same. What the f***? So what if these people are like... Imagine like people who have been around since, say, World War One or World War Two, And their offspring just kept following their, it's, I don't know, I don't traditions know. or way of life. I don't or, know. So a little while ago, which actually you, you kind of pointed something out there. I'm just going to start the car because it's, yeah, yeah, no problem, it's chilly and uh, we kind of want to warm so. up a little bit. Um, but yeah, a little while ago, you, you made a good point because a little while ago I found a bayonet. I showed it to you, right? Yeah, like the this one is that I found. old, yeah. old stuff. So I took it to somebody who actually knows what the hell they're looking at. Yeah. And apparently it's a World War One German bayonet. Oh, okay. Yeah. So that thing's probably killed some people. Yeah. Right? That that was at one point in time used in war, mm -hmm. which is crazy to think about. And now we're finding these. I know. Like, I don't even know what Dude, the hell that's supposed to mean. I just hope that you didn't come across some, like, inbred or, like, you know what I mean? Like, a group of people that have literally been living off the land and, like since these times like they're like like i said their offspring yeah. just keeps going and their their way of life is different than ours but i wonder if these have been fired i wouldn't really know how to check but... oh if you look at the back yeah. and you see almost like a pencil prick yeah, in the yeah. center ring that means it's been shot yeah they've been fired yeah 
That's crazy. That's crazy. Like, I, why I own guns. That's why I, I know. I don't understand. Yeah, I noticed that before too. I kind of figured that that's what that was. But um, I, I don't. I don't know. I don't really understand. We'll just put those away. Yeah, huh? you owe them. Like right. Owe them what? what so did it said you do something about we dealt with Sergey, who is the leader of the Viserians. <gasps> Yeah. I don't oh know, my God! I don't know if I ever mentioned that. Yeah, you didn't. So, like, what is that supposed to mean? I don't understand what that means. Well, we never dealt with him. I mean, from what I heard, he got I mean, himself kinda, put in prison. Yeah, but kind of indirectly, right? Mm -hmm. Like his all these people are just kind of everywhere at this point. But these Parker people, like, I'm still trying to figure out what the hell these guys are all about. Yeah. They're sending me weird messages one after the other, right? Um. Like, the other day, there was an entire story, which I will put at the end of this clip, just for context. Wow. Um, so, you, in case you guys missed that last video, which I still highly recommend watching anyways. Um, but, yeah, there was an entire thing that I found that kind of explained who they are, what they are, and what they're out for, I guess. Mm -hmm. So, do you think these Parker people are completely separate than from the Viserians? I have no idea. I, okay. I could give you absolutely no answer whatsoever because I don't even know what these people are realistically mm -hmm. all about. It's just really, really strange. Um, but anyways, yeah, 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 that's wild. So I think we're at the end of uh, this experience. Um, we may <laughs> go and do maybe another point or two for Brad's video. Um, so of course, go and check that out. But yeah, apart from that. Smash the like button again if you guys want to support the channel. Feel free to get some merch or maybe become a member. Um, I'll probably be able to do some extra content for you members very, very soon. So look out for that. Maybe even some member live streams as well. I think that would be fun. Mm -hmm. Very small, intimate group. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Smash the like button and uh, let's get the hell out of here. It's weird because there's like no one here. Yeah, I know. Oh, I just realized something. What? I forgot about this. When we were out there, we saw that moving light. And I said, yeah, is that not that where the weird. car is? Right? Do you think it was? I don't know. I don't know. It's hard I mean, to do say. you see any other lights right now? I don't see anything. So no. Just, uh, mm. just emptiness. <laughs> there was one thing I was going to mention, though. Yeah. Going back to this, well, whoever these people are. Mm -hmm. um, didn't you notice that those peas on the globe, they were, they were drawn on particular places. Yeah, I noticed that. So maybe that has something to do with this whole puzzle that you've gotten yourself into. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know what any of it's supposed to mean. Yeah, I know. You guys let me know down in the comments what you think is uh, is going on. I have <laughs> no idea. Uh, am Unveil I the mysteries. Am I being hacked? <laughs> like, I don't I don't, I don't understand. <laughs> Um, okay, let's let's just get the hell out of here. We'll figure it out later. But again, smash the like button, subscribe, turn notifications on, and uh, yeah. All right, <laughs> let's go.